In this session, our focus will involve loading an untrusted website. Depending on your browser, there will be a different message, but it all comes down to a security issue. It's recommended we do not visit the site. However, there may be a scenario for us to test this type of application. On Firefox, the message says, warning, potential security risk ahead. It's letting us know that an attacker could try to steal our information. Chrome has a similar message about attacker might be trying to steal your information with the heading that says your connection is not private. Edge has the same message as Chrome. Our automation test script will ignore these security warnings and load the page. If I click the advanced button, we see a link that says continue to self sign in dot bad SSL dot com unsafe. Click this link and the self hyphen sign dot bad SSL dot com site loads without a problem. GitHub has more examples just like this one. We see five sites that have subdomains that will generate the same type of warning. For our test script, it's already been set up for Chrome driver and dev tools. The last statement assigns get devs tools to dev tools. Let's start by creating a method with at test public void name the test name the method load bad website next we create a session with dev tools dot create session now we are going to send a command to ignore the certificate error dev tools dot send security dot security provides access for us to set ignore certificate errors this statement is similar to clicking the advanced button and the unsafe hyperlink we pass in a boolean value of true true is another way of saying we trust the website so it will successfully load the page that's it Last part is to load the AUT driver dot get and I think the website is https colon two forward slashes self hyphen signed bad ssl dot com. The key is to ignoring the certificate error by passing in true. A negative test case is pass in false, which will not load the untrusted website. Now I'm going to paste the code from what we just used to ignore and change true to false. Change the name from load bad website to do not load bad website. Let's run. They both pass. One browser shows self signed bad SSL.com, and the other browser shows your connection is not private. That, that's it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next session. If you're interested in more videos, 
feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell icon. Also follow me on Twitter, connect me on LinkedIn and Facebook. The transcript and code will get placed on GitHub and I'll see you again. Books available in paperback, ebook, and PDF. All Part 1 ebooks and PDF documents are free. Programming books for UFT. Programming books for Java. Here's the Selenium Automation Book. And Test NG. Subscribe to get notification of future videos. Don't forget to like, comment, and share.